Hi everyone, I'm Donna from the Land Rover Guidebook channel. Today, let's take a look at the radio among the various media of Land Rover vehicles. Tap the media on the home screen to start the radio. If the engine is restarted after the vehicle has been completely shut down, it will start from the radio. You can also tap the source in the upper left of the radio screen and select the radio. You can also tap the source icon on the left side of the home screen media panel and select radio. You can tap the band on the left menu of the radio screen and select FM or AM. Tap favorites to select your favorite channels. There is also a favorites icon on the right side of the home screen media panel. Find is at the bottom of the left menu on the radio screen. There is also a find icon in the center of the home screen media panel. The lists in the find are stations that can be received at the current vehicle's location and change frequently from region to region. You can scroll up and down by pressing the left arrow or the scroll bar. Tap the star next to the station and it will fill in white. A white star also appears in the upper left corner of the radio screen and is saved as a favorite. Tap the favorites menu to see the saved stations. You can disable the favorite by tapping the white star in the list. You can save it as a favorite by tapping the star of the station again on the radio screen. Like this, you can tap the star to save it to your favorites or delete it. You can tap the skip icon on the radio screen to select the next or previous station. The same applies to the split screen on the right. Or swipe your finger across the screen. Depending on the direction, you can skip to the next or previous station. Tap the empty space on the radio screen to see the station information. You can tap the back icon to go to the previous screen, but you can also tap the station info screen. Tap the speaker icon on the right split screen to mute the sound. When using other functions besides media, tap the round media screen on the right split screen to go to media shortcut. Tap find and add some stations to your favorites from the station list. Organizing your favorite stations in this way can help you focus more on driving. When you have selected all the stations you wanted to save to your favorites, tap the back icon and select the favorites menu. They will be organized in the order you saved them to your favorites. There is a frequency input menu next to the station list in the find menu. If you have a known frequency, you can find it by typing it directly here. Finally, you can also find by genre. Now, let's look at the radio settings. Tap settings at the bottom of the radio screen, then tap AM FM settings in the upper right corner of the settings pop-up. The top RDS is a radio data system. When disabled, all items below will disappear. Disabling the traffic alerts will also cause the TEA icon in the upper right corner of the screen to disappear. Activating the news provides news information. You can set the station list order alphabetically and numerically. If you enable alternate frequencies, the radio channels will continue to tune to stronger alternative frequencies to continue listening to the current broadcast channel. If you enable regionalization, no regional switching occurs. Therefore, you must deactivate the regionalization to switch alternate frequencies. Tap settings at the bottom of the home screen to display the settings pop-up window. The audio settings are located in the lower right corner of the settings pop-up. You can customize the sound settings for the bass, treble and subwoofer. You can also adjust the position of the center round sound spot with four arrows around the vehicle graphic on the right screen. If your country supports DAB radio, a menu appears in the media source. Please note that the usage is similar to AM-FM radio. So far, we've learned about radio in the media. In the next video, we will learn about USB in the media. Please do not forget to subscribe. Thank you very much.